Um, hi. So a recent study has shown that it's actually better for kids growing up if they have a few intimate friends than a lot of friends, like being popular. I'm still waiting for the no friend study to come out. <laughs> Thank you. Good night. It's fine. You seem like you're getting some laughs up there. I mean, I guess, but how was your day? Some crazy shit went down at work today. Work? Don't get ahead of yourself. It's a summer internship. Anyways, I was doing some really important stuff, really important work, and I took a break for like a minute, like a second. I started playing Tetris, and this guy Mike, he's a total creep, comes over. And he's like, working hard, little lady? Yeah. I mean, who is he, some work expert? Expert? You could learn some quitting habits from me. Your smoker's breath is awful. It may be dark, but I can hear that eye roll from here. Hold on. What's up? Sorry. This is just total BS. What happened? My brother just texted me. Jessica is gonna crash in my room tonight, so... Your room? We have the same effing room. I guess you could stay at my place. That's not the point. Thank you. It's not the point. Why? It's just what friends do. <laughs> you know, I can't go to your place, right? Why not? Uh, do you remember? Your mom wouldn't even let you bring in that stray cat. Really? Yes. When we were kids? <laughs> were kids? Yes. Do you think she'll take in a stray person? You have a point. Because you gave me your bomb pop. What? You can stay with me because you gave me your bomb pop. You coming? We were kids at the beach and I dropped mine. On the brink of tears, you gave me your bomb pop. It's frozen sugar water. No, it's it's more than that. Okay, Miss Sentimental. better for kids growing up if they have a few intimate friends than a lot of friends like being popular. I'm still waiting for the no friend study to come out. 